Hi guys, welcome back to the Go Anfield channel. The controversial scenes at the end of the 1-1 draw at Anfield two weeks ago are still on the agenda. Jeremy Doku hit Alexis McAllister in the chest with a boot raised in the area and the referee, together with VR, ordered the game to continue much to the frustration of Reds manager Jurgen Klopp. The controversial incident in the dying moments of the match has ignited a firestorm of debate, fueled by the immense significance of the fixture. Both teams are locked in a tight Premier League title race separated by a mere point alongside Arsenal. Speaking in the latest episode of Mic'd Up, Webb said he understood why the incident was so controversial, but believes the referee and VAR acted correctly. Webb made a completely contradictory statement regarding the game's rule, because anyone who understands even minimally about football knows that such a play outside the penalty area would be a foul and a yellow card. But why not call the foul inside the penalty area? Well, for Mr. Webb, the play was clean. See what he said. And split a lot of opinion hasn't it and i think it's one of those for sure if the referee gives it on the field it would have been a check complete by the var and equally having not given it it's also check complete you hear michael oliver say the ball's in between two players going together the ball is too low to head doku lifts his foot to play the ball and he does make contact on the ball and yes we know there's some contact on McAllister as well McAllister comes into him McAllister is not really playing the ball either so i understand why it's split opinion i think it would have been check complete either way not wanting to, to re-referee the game in situations that are not really clear, which is what we think the VR is for in this situation. The VR stays out of it. I think that is what we would we would expect. It's a 11-all game. You just want certainty, really. You want to, to know with clarity, with certainty, that you're making the right decision. Clearly, Michael didn't have it in this situation. And then the VAR looks at it and doesn't see a clear and obvious situation. You see something that's pretty subjective and therefore stays out of it. And the feedback we've had from people within the game is that this is a pretty subjective situation. It's split opinion. This is a clear foul and a yellow card in any position on the field. While he made contact with the ball, the reckless positioning of his foot created a dangerous situation. It should have been a penalty. Any true football fan would likely agree with this call. Webb was better off keeping quiet than talking so much nonsense. Thanks for watching. You will never walk alone.